Welcome to the vendor training course, Securing with SecureView. In this course, I will go over the benefits of boarding with SecureView, how to obtain stock of this product, and the installation steps. Let's begin. SecureView clear boarding is a unique alternative to traditional boarding. It is the installation of clear polycarbonate board up system. This type of boarding gives the appearance of traditional windows, allowing natural light to enter the property, all the while ensuring the property is secure. SecureView was originally introduced in July of 2013 in Illinois and Ohio test markets and is now available nationwide. It's been found that the benefits of securing a property with SecureView are the following. The ability to see into and out of the property. The product withstands inclement weather. It is made of unbreakable polycarbonate. The property is secured from the inside with no damage to the interior. It reduces blight and assists with stabilizing neighborhoods by reducing the stigma associated with seeing a boarded up property. Now that you understand what the SecureView product is and the benefits of using it, let's review how to install this product. First, you need to have the correct tools for installation. The tools required include a 120 VAC circular saw with a high tooth count blade, carbide recommended, half inch and 7 16 inch spade bits, countersink, 3 8 carriage bolts, Length determined based on window depth, stock 6, 8, 10, 12 inch bolts, washers, nuts, 3 8 inch coupling nuts that are at least 2 inches in length, and 3 8 steel threaded rods to extend carriage bolts if needed. Security screws, minimum 2 inch length, no Phillip or flathead screws, star, hex, or square head acceptable. Impact drive and or a cordless screw gun, bolt through ratchet for 3 8 nuts, open end wrench or crescent wrench, fence, cut table, table clamps, black sharpie marker, white labels, tape measure, rags for cleanup, basic window cleaner, a glass suction cup grab bar for easy transportation is recommended, and most importantly, shatterproof safety glasses. You also need stock of SecureView material. To obtain stock, you will register at www.secureviewusa.com. Once registered, you can place your initial stock order. We recommend that you purchase initial stock prior to the state rollout requiring the use of this product. The amount purchased is based by state volume. When the state becomes active, it is your responsibility to make sure you have the appropriate materials to meet our clients' guidelines, expectations, and time frames. We recommend you consistently maintain an inventory that will meet volume requirements. Since the product is not readily available at hardware stores, such as Home Depot or Lowe's, and has to be purchased to the manufacturer, maintaining an inventory is your best option. However, we will not hold you to a required inventory volume. Once you have been trained on installing SecureView, it will be unacceptable to not meet the client's request to board with SecureView because you don't have the materials or can't get the materials quickly enough. SecureView recommends that you utilize Cutlass Plus to calculate exactly how much material you need to secure a property. This is a software that lets you quickly generate optimized sheet layouts that make the most efficient use of your SecureView sheets. Once you have all the necessary tools and materials, you'll want to set up your cut table. Now you're ready to install the product by following these steps. Step 1. Identify the opening where you're going to install the product. Step 2. Measure the opening and cut the sheet appropriately. Be sure to document all measurements. Step 3. Mark panels and braces. Using Cutlass Plus for this step will dramatically help control costs and minimize waste. Measurements from your window openings need to be transposed to the panel for cutting. Step four, cut the panel and braces to size. Step five, mark the locations of the holes for the bolts and boring. Step six, do a final check. Measure twice, cut once, and bore once. Step seven, Remove film from the product and prep panel to install. Step eight, install the bracing system. The bracing is installed onto the carriage bolts with a backer nut, a flat washer, and then the braces. You will finish with a flat washer and nut. The bracing system is then sandwiched with a nut, washer, brace, washer, and nut. Step nine, clean window opening, sill, and panel thoroughly. Be sure to wipe completely free of debris and static. Once the installation is complete, you will perform one more final check and review utilizing the Safeguard SecureView checklist, which you will submit with your order results. In order to properly install SecureView, a flat level surface is required on the exterior for the panel to rest against. 
and the interior for the bracing system to rest against. Additional lumber may be required if a flat surface is not present. Our client guidelines require us to cover the entire window opening, not just a damaged sash. In some applications, like a single hung unit with an intact side sash, you're required to screw the panel back into the window for security in a completed installation. This requires the use of a security screw. Don't forget to take photos before, during, and after. The following photos are required for all windows where SecureView has been installed. Interior full shot of each window, interior full shot of each window with identifying label, and exterior full shot of each window. Photos are also required of the following from one window per installation. Bracing length, interior, backer nut, and washers on bracing system. Recessed bolt heads, interior window sill, exterior window edges and tolerance, and exterior screw head, if installed. I hope you found this course helpful. To learn more about the proper way to secure properties, view our additional securing related courses.